test result in CSV format. Okay, let me tell you the command. See, this is the command. Okay, I can delete this one. How to run JMeter script in command line, which is a non GUI mode. See, I have <coughs> given the command JMeter hyphen n hyphen t space. This is my JMX file. This is a small l iphone hyphen l. It will give you like this. So where where you want to generate? This is my path. So let me tell you one uh, tip. While you are generating, generating CSV test file, test result files. There is no space in the path. See, if I am giving, it is see, it is not separated with underscore. If I am giving the space, then command line will give you one error. Okay. Instead of avoiding those errors, just you need to provide underscore in the path in your path. In your path, there is no space okay, between any words, letters. Okay. Before uh, generating this CSV or test result for running, please check your path. Same, this is a folder structure I have created. I will show you. See, this is a folder structure. See, there is no space in space in my path. If it is space, then your script will give you error message i will show you how it is giving the error message okay and here the explanation coming to so what is this iphone n means a passage j meter to run in non gui mode <coughs> and what is the iphone t iphone t means this is the name of the gmx file which is have test plan Okay, this is a JMX file which is having text plan. So, what is the iPhone L? What is this iPhone L? Name of the JMeter test logs file to log the test results. Okay, I am logging the test result into test result.csv file. So here, I have already generated. So, let me one, one. I will give you one. Why this? I have already generated the test result that CSV file. Okay. Okay. Let me run. Okay. CMD. Before that, you need to close your test result and save. Okay. What is the test plan you have created? JMX file. Close this one. Okay. It is closed. CMD. Okay. And uh, coming to my JMeter bin path. What is the JMeter bin path? This is my JMeter means F, F drive. Okay, go to F drive, CD, just enter F, semicolon, hyphen, this one, enter. Just go to CD, Java, just enter and space tab. Okay, CD, Apache, <coughs> sorry, CD and bin. Okay, you have to go to this JMeter bin path. Okay, why? Because I have saved my uh, JMX file in this folder only. <coughs> Sorry, this folder is in JMX. Okay, now enter this command. It's very cold. Okay, JMeter iPhone N iPhone T. This is my JMX file iPhone L. This is my path. See E Q T P. Okay, there is no gap in between words. Words. Okay. If you enter this CSV file, just just click on enter. It will writing your log. See, creating summarizers application JMeter log, creating the tree successfully using software testing dot JMX file. Starting the test Friday. Today is a Friday. Okay, January 6. See here, January 6. So everything it is giving the IST Indian Standard Time. 
waiting for possible shutdown stop service uh, heap uh, dump message on port double four triple four five okay summary is a four in zero milliseconds 1.0 per second average is a 931 minimum is a 573 maximum is a 1223 second error zero so tidying up so this is a given end of the run it is already generated means sorry see okay just go to your uh, this result.cm file see i have it is generated if you open this one it will give you each and every summary report details so what is a timestamp okay same what is a elapsed time it is giving what is a label this is a label and what is a response response message it will give you thread name give you data type success okay success to if it is having any failure message i will give you failure also let me show you method threat latency ideal type okay let this is for pass scenario okay let me run for failure scenario how it will give you uh, before that i will show you if you not giving any giving space between um, what do we call between words then how it will give you the error message okay let me take one space uh, I will take you this, this is a space okay here I want to generate the result file it is giving space right let me copy this one it is result.csv copy from here sorry it's this side okay this uh, I'm giving this path. Let's see how it will give you the error message. I click and paste. Click and enter. See, it is giving. See, writing to log file, jmeter.log. So, I'm giving an error occurred. Unknown arguments, UI. Means, what are the space it is giving? See, soap iPhone UI. So, what are the space it is having? It is not considering and considering from UI part. That's why it is giving an error level 1. Error level 1. <coughs> Sorry. Just click on enter. So that's why if you are generating your TSC result dot something CSV or JTL file, there is no space between the words. What are the path you are going? That should not be any space. Okay. So now we may have to run for what we have to run for failure scenario. Let me open the JMX file. Jmeter, Jmeter, open the Jmeter. If you have any doubts, please provide in the form of comments. Okay, we will clarify your doubt. Let's open fair testing. Okay, coming to in response. Let me give you response. Russian, I will not give you anything. Is giving the testings okay let me save so this is coming under this one so let me drag and drop here response and it is having a you can delete this one and I want to response session I have given as okay so I want to give as 300 is the okay so response message I'm giving and the response code I want to say 300 okay so this one will become as a failure so let me increase the number of threads to ramp up period 2 so troop count is a 1 okay let me save this one and we will run in command line so for failure as well as pass message okay look runners get uh, tutorials j meters okay test result cmd okay i want to change the file name for failure fail that's all fail let me run this file command how it will give you let's check this one enter it's creating summarize created tree now it is taking time see one by one it is running tidying up end of run it is taken see 
so average is 107 to minimum is 525 milliseconds okay maximum is 1.686 seconds okay error is a 2 error is 2 here giving error here giving error is a 4 so why because for 2 HTTP samples I have given the response message okay let's see how it has generated test result underscore fail let me open file see it is given test fail code expected to match 300 but it has given the response code as a 200 okay so that's why it is giving the message as a 2 when coming to here see testings contains testings testings I have given right there is no testings it has contains why because I have given as a software testing tutorial okay APM interview questions I have given so but in that one there is no testings things it is giving the plural testing that's why it has given the failed message as a 2 why because 2 times it has run set count is a 2 1 2 total is a loop count is a 1 so that's why it is given total is a 4 here 1 here 1 here 2 total is count is a 4 it is given as a 4 total is a 4 here is 2 50 percent 50 percent 4 okay so like this you can run your script in the command line with the help of this command okay i hope uh, you understood uh, this command line how to run your jms demeter script in command line with non-gui mode okay could you uh, understood this one if you have any doubts please provide me in the form of comments and suggestions on this video and please subscribe to my videos and please share in social media so that so, that, uh, so many members are looking to learn geometry like this videos I have given with the real time examples please uh, stay tuned to my channel in next video I will give you the more details about the geometers okay thank you thank you for watching my videos